everyone, it's me, Alex, and everyone's favourite bird, Archie. Today I am unboxing the Jeffree Star Halloween Mystery Boxes. Better late than never, I suppose. I bought these off Jeffree Star Cosmetics on the day that they launched. That was quite some time ago and they've just turned up. I got the small, medium and the large. This is my first time buying a Jeffree Star Mystery Box. I have no idea what to expect. Obviously the small box is very, very small, so I'm going to let little Archie here unbox that one. And then Tiasha is going to unbox the middle size box and I'll unbox the large one. Tiasha, my good friend, she has a darker skin tone to me, so it's really good to compare swatches on both of our skin tones because some shades really turn up a lot different on darker skin to how they turn up on lighter skin. So once we've swatched everything, we're also both going to do a full face of makeup. Archie here is not going to be able to do a full face of makeup. I'm very sorry. He can help. I'm sure he's going to have fun unboxing this. I find it very fun to watch my precious son unbox presents. You may not like that, but there are timestamps below if you want to skip through and see the most important parts to you. So with that, let us jump into the small mystery box. This is a lot smaller than I thought. I mean, I should have known from the name small, no idea what's going to be in here. The medium and the large boxes actually gave you the option on the website on Jeffree Star Cosmetics. You were able to choose a size. It said, please select your size. So I'm guessing there's going to be pieces of clothing in the medium and the large boxes. So without further ado, would you like to jump into box number one, Archie? What? What? All right, ready? What's in here? Now, if you sit there, you're gonna have a look. What, what's in there? I'm sorry guys, we're not beauty gurus, we are birdie gurus. Please be patient with us. Do you need me to, I can take that away if you like. What's item number one? This isn't going to plan. He's gone for the green thing. Why don't you start with something small? You wanna grab one of these things? You can, you can open it. What's in there? What's that? Can you pick it up? They say never work with children or animals. <laughs> oh, there we go. Okay, what have we got? No, we still wanna go for the big one. I just made it 10 times easier for you. <laughs> Good boy. Okay, so. Oh, that was uh, item number one there that we have just yoked. So number one, we have a lip ammo. Now I have not seen this bright, vibrant packaging before. I'm not sure what collection that this is from. This is lip ammunition in the shade brown sugar. Not impressed. So the first item is indeed a lip ammo. Would you like to show it to them? Please show them. <laughs> What's the second item? Okay, second we have, now this is a very interesting looking lipstick. This is actually, this seems to be Halloween edition because the box is black and orange. So this may be an exclusive for Halloween. So this is a very unusual color. This is like almost a black in the tube. It looks like black with flecks of gold all over it. There's one more in here, liquid lipstick, and it is a pink one. This just seems like a standard Jeffree Star liquid lip. So there's two liquid lipsticks, one lip ammo, and a mini breaker palette. I feel like these mystery boxes are a good investment if you don't have a large range of Jeffree Star Cosmetics products. I do have a fair few of them in my collection, so this isn't necessarily great use for me. I do love the packaging of the mini breaker and the jaw breaker palettes. I think it's very luxurious packaging. We love this vibrant green, don't we? So that's it. So in the small mystery box, I have the shade Cherry Wet for liquid lipstick. We have the shade Soul Sucker, which seems to be like a, a Halloween one. We also have a lip ammo in brown sugar. Do you have a favorite? A 
I take that as a no. So that's the small size. Let's move on to the medium size. We will call Tiasha in here to unbox this one. I'm sure Archie would love to unbox this one, but at the moment he just seems to be yeeting everything all over the place. What do you think so far, Archie? Do you like it? Must be disappointing to unbox a present and find that there's nothing inside that's any use to you. I'm very sorry. Okay, so let's call Tiasha in. We will unbox these other two and then let's get on to doing a full face of makeup using makeup from the Jeffree Star mystery boxes. Okay, so I have Tiasha here with me. We are going to be trying out the makeup. We'll swatch it on both of us. Uh -huh. Do a full face. Yeah. What do you know about these boxes? Uh, I literally didn't even know they existed. <laughs> really? <laughs> Today. So, really? Yeah, I had no idea. <laughs> yeah, so this is something he seems to do seasonally, I guess. There's the Halloween mystery boxes. I, I think he's done one or two other mystery boxes so far and I know he's doing one for the Christmas period, I'm pretty sure. Okay. I ordered this, you know, as a Halloween mystery yeah. box. It turned up well after Halloween. Yeah. Like, if there's a Christmas box, they're always going to be late. It's yeah. going to be very, very late. Even so, on an island. A very big island in with Krenet. a lot of people on yeah. the island. <laughs> You'd think they would get it no to us. No one cares about Australia. No one cares. Uh, actually, if you've ordered these and you are international to America, maybe you're in Canada or somewhere in Europe, please tell me how long it took to get to you because it took almost a month to get to me. Oh, so, okay. basically, you get an assortment of products so oh wow you got a full mini breaker in that guy this yeah that's and right how much was that box I'm a YouTuber. I'm supposed to know these things. So Alex, how much was that one? Oh, well, it was 40 US dollars. Oh, so impressive that you memorized that off the yeah. top of your head. So, uh, so the small 40 US dollars, you get the mini breaker and then you get two liquid lips and a lip ammo. Now to me, I think that's all right. That's amazing. I you think that's really good there, because yeah. I'm pretty sure from memory, these are about, are they like 15 each or something? I think so. Yeah, and then lip ammo is something similar, maybe 15 each. This is definitely worth more than I think that's about $35, yeah. I'm pretty sure. So For good sure. value, I would say good value. <gasps> oh, wow, there's clothing. Yes, oh they, they ask for sizes. <gasps> so this is an XL, whatever this is. Oh my God, this is a 3XL. This yes. is so cool already. <laughs> Can't relate with bo bony hands. <laughs> There you go. That's, that's Jeffrey Thanos snapping his fingers right there and all the other beauty gurus disappear. <laughs> it's just such a silly tea. Can't relate. Like, all these t-shirts are so like... Yeah. You can have that if you like. I got it in a 3XL so my husband could wear it, but I don't think my husband will ever wear that. And you're wearing this. This is a $75 box. Okay. So at the moment we have a t-shirt. That looks like it's going to be another mini breaker. <laughs> Oh my god. Is no. It? Wait. Yes. Oh. I'm so sorry. Oh, it is. Okay. Oh. We can do a giveaway. Right. So if you want to head over to my Instagram, it's Pretty Pastel Please. I'll put together some stuff from these boxes and do a giveaway over there. Nice. So we've got a mini breaker. So nice. again, I think that's about 30 something dollars. <gasps> the gloss. I wonder if the Shane gloss has a different texture to the standard gloss. Yes, this is called Crystal Climax. A little cheeky. Uh oh. <laughs> Sorry. We aren't the biggest fan of the lid. The component. A lot of people picked up on the fact that in the Shane Dawson review, I said at the start, yeah. I don't like the packaging. Yeah. And later on I said, I love this packaging. <laughs> what I mean is, I love this packaging. Yeah. This is very pretty. Mm -hmm. Personally, it's a little bit much. You yeah. actually said that you would buy this, but you'd feel awkward pulling it out in yeah. public. I'm not embarrassed about much, but to pull out a lip gloss that looks like this it's on the lot. bus and then be like, it's very Jeffrey and I get it. It's very yeah. in his brand, but it's, yeah. It's a lot. This color, this is very shimmery, not the same mm, as these, but yeah. see, it's got that same pearl yeah. essence to it. I wonder how like, cause these are glosses, right? So they wouldn't be, oh, there we go. Oh. 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 But that's a lipstick? This is, so this is Shane's I Gotta Go. <gasps> and it's a very similar color to this Crystal Climax. Mm. So that is already shimmery. So I don't know if you would put this over the top of that, but color wise, they do look quite similar. Very interesting. We shall investigate further. Now I, I have all of these. So okay, you I'm not gonna open that. that. Great. So this is Michigan Ice. So I will go pull this out of my collection. <laughs> I very rarely use these. Mm. I bought them so that I could review the collection and then the occasion didn't come up. I didn't end up reviewing it. And I haven't used them since because they're like a a liquid highlight. 
but it's got a bluish tint to it, so it's unusual. Uh, unusual. Skin so, Frost. Oh, Do you have this? Oh, this is a limited edition one for Halloween. It's called Mystery ah, Frost. It's called Mystery is Frost. Is the shade Mystery Frost or yeah. is it a Mystery no, Frost? No, that's probably the shade name. Oh, well, there yeah. you go. So this is for Halloween. This is an exclusive. Now, a lot of people Ooh. online said that theirs turned up and it was broken. <gasps> okay, it's definitely called Mystery Frost. Ready? <gasps> ah! <laughs> What the? Wait, is it supposed to be like that? Yes. Oh my god. I was expecting that, you weren't. As you guys can see, it has unusual little flecks in it, and um, ah! a lot of people when they received this, they were like, is my highlight moldy? <laughs> No, That's what I no, it's intended to be like that. But why on earth would you want black? It probably doesn't come up as black, I'm guessing. <gasps> oh, it comes oh, up oh, as black. black. Swatch it on your wrist. Oh, I, it's it is. definitely it's black. black. <laughs> Again, we'll investigate further. Investigate yeah. further. A lip ammo. What shade is that? Okay. Snow cone. Snow cone. Okay, different to the one that I got in the small box. So this again looks like it's from the Jawbreaker collection. Snow cone. Okay, Snow here we cone. go. Oh, oh. wow, we. That is wow. so pretty. It's like a glossy green by the looks of it. That's very interesting. That you want to come see? You. Of course you do. Look. What is that? I'm really interested to see what that looks like on the lips. It really looks beautiful. Mm. You know. And like, last but not least, Christmas cookie. Oh, cute. Oh, Christmas cookie. Isn't that from the holiday 2017 collection? Correct me if I'm wrong. Yeah, open it up. It's not the limited edition one with the pink sparkles. But I think that that's one of the shades. I love that it. That is beautiful. That's a very nice wow. shade. That's gonna. I think that'll look nice on both of us. I don't know. It's a little light for me, but this reckon? is just tasty as heck. So seventy-five dollars. There's a liquid frost, mini mm. breaker, mm. a unique highlight, a gloss, an ammo, and a liquid lipstick, and a t-shirt. I don't think we're ever gonna doubt the value of these, right? He couldn't be ripping people off and doing this constantly. Like it no, is a lot. No, I think of it's stuff. good value. I think yeah. it's definitely good value. The large box is a jump in price. It's hundred and sixty dollars. Who the heck is spending that on a mystery box? Is it? It could be a present though, right? Is that yes, what these are for? But I mean, you don't buy presents for Halloween. No, you're right. What the heck is this? Oh, do you in America though? Maybe do they you? Do they give gifts at Halloween time in America? Ponders in Australian. <laughs> now uh, I might just leave this on the ground because it's it's actually really, really, really heavy. For hundred and sixty dollars, this better be like half of <gasps> his entire suit? website. <gasps> It's the uniform. <laughs> I'm so jealous. Really? I'm so jealous. I want it. Do you really? Oh, I'm so I should have ordered this in the extra large. I'm so sorry. <laughs> it's a horrendous color. But I love yeah, I don't think I'll ever wear that. I mean, maybe I will. This is a size oh. small. Should I suit up? Yes. Yeah, I'll suit up for the makeup half suit of the video. Up. That's both pieces of this tracksuit. I don't know what the tracksuits retail for on the website. I'll put it up on the screen and bear in mind with that price on the screen that this entire box is 160. Mm. Okay, we have, is this another mini break? <laughs> yeah. Okay, no, Jeffrey does not know one girl's ordering all three of them to be fair. That's very true. <laughs> this is my own fault. Yes, it's another mini, you get a mini breaker, you get a mini breaker, Archie, you, you get, get a mini breaker. <laughs> You are a mini breaker. Yes, you are. We've got three. Mm. So there's a mini breaker in every single box. I already have the mini breaker, so we'll use that to do our full face mm -hmm. makeup later so that the three can go into like a giveaway situation. Oh, wow. Oh, love me, love me not. This is a liquid a mini lipstick collection. I have never bought any of the Jeffree Star mini lips ever. Look at this beautiful That's box. Lovely box. What colors are. <gasps> This is so pretty. Oh my god. I, I'm blown away. I did not expect to get something like that in this box. It's so he does he sell it as this? Yeah, on the website? yeah. He Do sells, you know how much this is? We'll put it up on the screen. I've wow. never bought one of the mini lipstick collections before. Uh, it makes sense to get mini lipsticks because the reality is that you very rarely actually finish mm. an entire tube of lipstick. Yes. From Jeffree Star at least. Like I've had some of them for a long time and I've never got through them. So the minis make more sense. That's a very nice variety of colours. I love every single colour in there. There you go. They wow. those colours are stunning. Wow, okay, keep going. Okay. This is already a very We have box. another lipstick here that looks like it's a Halloween lipstick. Are you going to open that up for me? Oh, I've never seen Archie do that in person. That's so incredible. Whoa! <gasps> so this shade is called Zombie Kiss and that is a 
stunning purple. I don't think I can wear this on my lips. Only for Halloween, baby. Only for Halloween. Easily uses like an eyeshadow or a liquid liner. Stunning. Um, are we doing looks after this? Yes, we Let's are. Let's go crazy. <laughs> There's a Supreme Frost mm -hmm. in Caramel Kiss. <gasps> that sounds delicious. I really like these Supreme Frosts. Mm -hmm. I really like the packaging. I think the packaging is really cool because <laughs> it's like a chrome pink. We have, what's this? A Scorpio. What are you? Oh, lip liner. You're, you're gonna love this component, Tiasha. It's <laughs> Oh, wow, okay. Yeah. So this is the shade Scorpio for this lip liner. So mm. this may work well with that purple lipstick, possibly. Mm. It seems like a dark grayish purple color. There's a metal straw. Oh, that's great. I've been wanting to get a metal straw for ages. <laughs> I wish it was a pink one, but obviously this is the Halloween mystery box. So it makes sense that it's a, a, an orange one. Yeah. It also has a cleaner with it. Yes, in nice. there. That's where the cleaner is hidden. <laughs> Venus flytrap. <gasps> Whoa! Wow! Whoa! Wow! Pastel green. That is a beautiful, beautiful green. I'm really happy with all these lip colors that are coming out of They're here. Also weird. I won't be able to use this no. as a lip color. It'll look ridiculous. This is an eyeshadow, though. Definitely some sort of eye thing. Yeah. We have a yummy. This is a lip ammo. Oh my oh, giddy wow. god! <gasps> okay, wow. that's. that's a that is a lavender lilac kind of lip color. That's really pretty. Again, kind of terrifies me as a lip color, but as a color in general, yeah. that's really beautiful. I'm excited to like swatch these and see what they actually look like. Yeah. And then we have a <laughs> lip scrub, cucumber mint. <gasps> Yummy. Do you like the sound of that? I love lip scrubs. Give it a woof. Oh, it smells very, very fresh. It smells like oh, a mojito. Mojito, or something. yeah. Yeah, yeah. Oh that my smells gosh, nice. Yum. That is a summer scrub. We're going to have to use that before we actually, maybe even in between every time yeah, that we try true. the lips. <laughs> Jeffree Star Prom Night. Is it's a vinyl. a vinyl. It's a vinyl. Oh, do you have a vinyl? Yes. Oh, you can have that. Woo! <laughs> wow. What the heck? I was not expecting that. That is so random. This is so cool. Have you heard this song? No. Oh, it's <laughs> so bad. It's <laughs> like the worst thing you'll ever hear, but mad respect, dude. It's a star That's, shaped I love vinyl. that it's star shaped. <laughs> That's so cool. And I'm guessing this is a mirror. Yep, this is a hand mirror. Wow. Can you open yeah. that? Oh, will it be a Halloween one? And you can use that. I'll use the other one that I have here. Very interested to see how some of these things look on the two of us. Yeah. We'll do swatches and then we'll do application. You might have to go, possibly. Sorry, buddy. You're very Sorry, buddy. Oh. oh no, that's so... <laughs> We're back. I'm in the tracksuit. We just noticed, we didn't even realize there's another mirror in the very bottom of the box. So it's the same mirror. So this can go in the giveaway. <laughs> Let me just talk about the tracksuit for a second. <laughs> it feels very well made. If you've been thinking oh. of buying one of these and maybe the price is frightening you, it's a really good tracksuit. <laughs> 55 US dollars for the jacket on its own, 45 US dollars for the pants. So, so in Australian dollars, that almost makes the whole box price. So pretty good value if you get the tracksuit because then everything else is basically free. Yeah, I'm very impressed by the quality of it. Obviously the mini breaker was in all of them. So let's have a look at that first. Mm -hmm. Okay, so let's start off with the shade <sighs> Double Scoop. Ooh, it's so soft. Okay. Ah. I don't know how well that's going to swatch. Ah. I don't know if people are going to be able to see that. We like to do a single swatch first and then we'll go over the top with a second layer. A double dip. Double scoop. Hmm. Wow, look how different the colors look. Okay, so color wise, I think it stands out a lot more on you than it does on me. Yeah. This is a really nice color. A nice sort of peachy color. Mm. From my experience using this, I will put this all over my lid. I really like the shade. So then we dip into Orange Crush. This really does look unused, Alex. Yeah, I know, but I <laughs> use so this confused. a lot. Ooh. Okay, <gasps> that's got some really, really nice little wow. glitter particles in it there. That's a lovely color. Okay, so that's the second layer on that shade. Again, what do you think in terms of color? I, I think, think it's stunning. It looks more of orange on you. On me, it looks red, and on yeah. you, I, it almost seems a little bit more orange. Yeah, how strange. Okay, next up we have Foreplay. Ooh. This is a really nice looking pinky wow. purple. Wow. Okay. <gasps> yep, this is, that's a, oh, I can't see mine. On camera, you wow. can't really see it, but on person, in it's person, really that looks bright. really nice on you. It looks deeper on you. Yeah, mine looks more blue toned and yours is like a warm. Yeah, these three colors together look really, really pretty. Yeah, they're stunning. Oh, one that's layer, another right. layer on me. One more on me. Wow. That's Huge pretty. difference. That's really pretty. Very, very big difference. Some of these shade names are, can't necessarily say some of these on YouTube. So next we're dipping into this shade here. Shan't be saying the name. <laughs> the shade that shan't be named. <laughs> 
Oh wow, this looks beautiful. Ready? Mm-hmm. Ooh. Huh, okay, let's do another layer. Sorry about my swatches, guys. I can't see what I'm doing. But, that being hmm. said. That looks very different. That looks so different on both of us. I'm amazed. That That's is crazy. so pretty. I love this color so much. All four of them together are getting more and more like That's epic. That's really nice. Yeah. All of those together. Yeah. Purple Punch is the next shade. Wow! You like that? Yes! That's a lovely color. I think in person that one looks a bit more vibrant mm. on you compared to me. I don't know about I think yours is quite the vibrant. Quite the vibrant. <laughs> I think on, on both skin tones these mm. colours look really, really nice though. I agree. Let's do a second. Wow. Just beautiful. That's a lovely Damn. colour. Damn. We've got <sighs> Slice. Now I love this shade. I use this from the inner corner to about halfway across <gasps> the lid. There you go. Oh my goddy god. Yeah, this is, that's an amazingly pigmented shade. Oh, it's I stunning! It. Look yeah. how dark it is on your skin and how light it looks on mine. Yeah, it looks very, very different on the Wowie. two skin tones. So, the next shade is Bubblegum. Ooh! And then on me. Okay, that comes up a lot better on you than it comes up on me. Do you think so? I feel like I can't see it at all. I think it, definitely at this upper part of mm. the swatch, it definitely fades out down here. Yeah. But up here, I can see it much better. Yeah, right. Go in with a second layer. Wow, it really looks pastel on me and it looks like a proper pink on you. Uh, next yes. up we have Bite Me. Wow. <gasps> Holy heck. That's a wow. I love this shade so much. We'll do a second layer, not that, not that you need yeah, it in any way at all. It almost, the second layer literally <gasps> doesn't even do anything. <laughs> yeah, it's like too because, much on you. It's, yeah, because it's already so <laughs> much just in one layer. And yeah, then the last lovely. shade is Hot Fudge. Ooh, yum. Okay, so that is kind of ashy on me. Yeah. This is not as pigmented as some of the other matte yeah. shades. That colour, I don't know how that looks on you. Yeah, it doesn't look that great on me. And that's a second layer I've put there and mm. it didn't really intensify it. My one looks more like a grey almost on yeah, my skin Yeah, it does. Tone. It pulls grey. Yeah. I can see brown here. Yeah. Brownish grey, but on you it definitely looks yeah. grey. So that's mini breaker there. <laughs> so you get the mini Pretty. breaker at least Sorry. from all three boxes that I got, there was a mini breaker. Yeah. Let us know if you guys got anything yeah, else. Yeah, a different product, maybe like a highlight palette, like Brain Freeze or something. That's the palette for all of them. So we're doing lips now. Wait, before we do this, should we use the lip scrub? Yes. The <laughs> lip scrub was in the big one. Oh my god, I love this stuff. Okay. Oh, I don't know if I like it mm -mm. taste-wise. It definitely pulls strong flavors of cucumber for sure. Mm. I really like sweet lip scrubs. A bit too healthy for me. <laughs> We have brown sugar with the lip ammo. So mm -hmm. you put that on. All right, so I'm going in with brown sugar. So we're trying out the lip ammo now. Tiasha's putting on brown sugar. Ooh. This is very, very shimmery. That looks so nice. It's okay. a delight to put on. There's something yeah. in it. Hmm. Okay, here we go. I went uh, in a few times. Wow, I actually find that much easier to apply than yeah. the liquid lip. <laughs> yeah, this is so oh. easy. Okay, there it is on the two different skin tones. I'm a fan. Definitely more gold on you. Mm. It looks much more peachy on me. Yeah, I This kind really of matches like my eye look too. Yeah. And it's like, very comfortable. Mm. I don't know if you're meant to use this alone or if it's more like a topper to put mm. on top of other colors. I would wear this alone. There we go. Two different skin tones for the shade Brown Sugar. I love it. Cherry Wet. Oh, I'm excited for this one. Oh. Ooh. Okay. And you? I like this. Oh, I love this. Oh, you make it look so easy to put on. I don't know why it takes me like 20 minutes. Because your lips on. are twice the size of mine. No. <laughs> That's why. <laughs> wow. Yeah, I love this. Mm. So good on you. It looks good on I you. I am dying. But ah. you know, my one qualm, mm. one, mm. is that it is a matte shade, but it's called Cherry Wet. And so for oh. me, I was almost imagining like this exact yeah. color, like glossy. Glossy, yeah. Cherry Wet would be a good name for a gloss, yeah. I would say. I really like this color on both of us. I think this is so pretty. And the last color that comes out of the small box, now this is, I believe, a Halloween exclusive. Oh, wow. So this one is called Soul Sucker. Nervous. <laughs> this is very dark. I. I don't wear dark lipsticks, but could be an occasion for it, potentially. Oh, it's black. Oh, wow. It's just straight up black. A little bit weird. Very translucent. Translucent and uneven. 
don't know what I think about this. I used to wear black lipstick a lot back in the day when I was an emo, but I've never had a black lipstick that does this weird kind of, see it's darker over here. It's just, see that, see the, sorry. See the weird ring? It's like, it's called butthole lips. I can't make this work. <laughs> okay, I give up. Here you go. It's just a shame that the consistency... I feel like it's going on more even for me. Like, that was one spread. I could be doing something wrong. How can you be doing Or wrong? maybe because your lips are a different colour to mine. Wow. This is really pretty. Very pretty. Wow, that worked very well on you. Yeah. That That's so easy. strange. Why? Big difference. On me, I just could not get it to be even, but it looks How very strange. even. That looks so nice on you. <gasps> can I try to do yours? Yeah, yes, you can. You may. Am I doing it wrong? I don't know. Don't expose me. <laughs> but like you can't put on liquid lipstick wrong. But it looks epic. Girl, I love this. Goth Alex is everything. Have to pull out my favorite Linkin Park t-shirt. Yeah. That I used to live in. <laughs> okay, hell yeah. Okay. Wow. You did it a lot better. <gasps> you look amazing. I love that. You should take that with you. Oh I have gosh. no use for that. You should keep that. <laughs> I really like the gold flex and I love that the black part is matte and then there's yeah. just little gold flex. It's nicer to me than like full on metallic yeah. all over the lips. Agreed. This is, this is more subtle. Like I do Yeah, like yeah. This is great. And is it any different on the both of us, do you think? I think it's fairly similar. Yeah. So there you go. That's mm. all the products that came out of the small box. Yes. So let's move on to the medium. Okay. So first things first, the weird skin frost, the moldy yeah. skin frost. <laughs> Very unusual skin frost. Let me give you another close up before we dive into this, just so you can see. So there it is, really very unusual. Don't know how I feel about this. I'm really interested to see if these black flecks actually pull in a swatch. Here we go. Oh, I don't see any black. Yeah, okay, so it looks like, th oh, wow, look at that, how weird is that? Can you see this lower part is a lot darker than the higher part? Because where I ran my fingers across it, I kind of did this, but I would have got a slightly different color pulling on one yeah. finger than the other. So I guess when you sort of put it all together, the black doesn't really show up. No, it rubs away or mixes into the two, because already you can see like on the palette, the black's rubbing away into the gold. Yeah, yeah. let's just do a second layer mm -hmm. on top. Not that you would necessarily, I mean, you might pile your highlighter on layer after layer. I would only go in lightly, but I'm just interested to see if going over it again. So there you go. Wow, uh, both of ours look like two different colors. They look very, very different. <laughs> very happy to see that the black does not come through because yeah. that would have been really, really unusual. So next up, we're gonna try this liquid frost. So this is the one that I already had. So the other one is still brand new. So this is the shade Michigan Ice. It looks very, very blue. I don't know why you would want a blue skin highlight. Or like a sexy Smurf. <laughs> so these have the dropper, so I'll just drop a bit there, Ooh. drop a bit there. Look how blue that is. Wow. <laughs> Why would I ever do that? A sexy smurf. I guess you could put a little amount maybe on your shoulders to pull a bit of blue. Yeah, if we like really, really rub this. Okay, that's slightly better. Okay, mine's basically just a little bit of a sheen now. Mm. Like I've really sort of rubbed it out yeah. and it pulls, I can see a bit of purple and mm. blue in there, but the blue's still coming through on you. <laughs> how strange. On to lips now. Interesting that it's snow cone, but it's green. Oh, okay. Oh, it's subtle. It looks like, <gasps> oh, interesting. That's very pretty. Oh, wow. Oh, it smells amazing. Oh, this is your flavor. It's oh. like white caramel. Wow. Mm. Mine's way brighter than yours. Whoa! <laughs> what it shows the hell? up so well on you. Mm. It's very glossy, almost looks more like a lip gloss than a lip gloss does. Mm. Mm. I feel like mine's really picking up the green and I yours can is see gold. The, oh my god, the green on you. Yeah. And it does like smell, like you would eat that. that it smells, smells so amazing. Good. So this is Christmas cookie. I'm so excited about this. Oh, it's gonna look good on you. Christmas cookie, you. Oh my god, Alec. What can I say? I'm coming for all the beauty gurus careers. <laughs> Your lips look like twice as big. What the heck? Instant lip <laughs> Instant. <laughs> okay, this is so easy to apply. This is a little bit sticky. I really like this formula. This is so nice. Oh, I think that looks really nice on you. Okay guys, what do you think? You don't like it? I just think that a lot of people in the last video said that these colors work if you put a lip liner. Yes. And I believe them. So I yeah. feel like this especially, like this isn't as bad as most light colors look and I actually really like it, but with a lip liner. I like this on both of us. 
Okay, for real though, look how different our lip colors look. They look so different. This looks darker. Wow, looks, so much darker. Yeah, looks way lighter on you. Wow. I reckon if you're wanting a Jeffree Star liquid lip but you're scared of the crazy mm. colors, mm. Christmas cookie, really Christmas cookie easy. Christmas cookie and cherry wet. Yes, easy colors to wear, very yeah. good. Mm. I just want to see what this looks like <gasps> at the top. Okay. Oh, get weird. <gasps> okay, get weird. Oh my goodness, she went there. Okay, so that was the green color I just put over the top. Doesn't pull any green. Because this is a matte lipstick, now it's just got a tiny little bit of sheen. Just Ooh. a little teeny, teeny, tiny bit of sheen to it. Wow, I wonder if mine's gonna pull more green than yours again. Ah, a little bit. Yeah. Just a little bit of green is yeah. coming through, not much at all. But there you go, that takes a matte lipstick to just like a little bit of a, a glossy, shimmery mm -hmm. level without being crazy metallic. Yeah. No green. <laughs> no. Good, I'm glad. <laughs> okay, and uh, then the last one is this gloss. Let's first of all, can you swatch this on your arm? Yes. And then swatch this Shane Dawson, I, I gotta go. Wow, that's not straight, sorry y'all. Wow. Okay, pretty. Very glossy. Pretty. And then I'll do it. You take that. And should I do this? Yeah, do I gotta go from Ooh. Shane. Okay, sh the, the Shane shade is ever so slightly darker. Yeah, there so is a slight difference. The top yeah. one is the Shane I Gotta Go, and the bottom one is the Lip Gloss Crystal Climax. Yeah, they are very, very similar. And the interesting thing is that the gloss is no less pigmented yeah. or dense than what the liquid lip is. How about you put on one, I put on the other. Okay. And then, right, so Tiasha's just put top. Shane's lipstick on the bottom, and now she's putting the gloss on the top lip, just to see the colour. I just have the gloss on at the moment. This is not a gloss, this is a lipstick. It's like a lipstick. I'm not used to seeing glosses that are that pigmented. There's so much colour in that gloss. In person, it almost looks the same. She's got the gloss on the top and the Shane lipstick on the bottom. When they're side by side like that on the mm. lip, there's more color on the lipstick yeah. than there is on the gloss. But the shade... It's the same... It looks the same color to me right now. This one's just less glittery, the gloss. Yeah. 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 Interesting. Ooh. I don't hate it. <laughs> yeah, I love this lip gloss. Great success. I liked all of the lip products mm. from that. Mm. I think the, the medium box so far mm. wins for mm. lip products. Yeah. Okay, so that's the medium box. Mm -hmm. Let's have a look at the large box. Ooh. So this lip liner is called Scorpio. Wow. Oh. It's so purple. Okay, so that's Scorpio. I thought that it was going to be more brown, but it's like a purplish gray. I like that on you. It's a little lighter than I would it's too. It's but... light on you compared to me. So I like this. I'm going to try this purple with okay. this. I would never wear a purple lip color necessarily. <gasps> You're about to get your mind blown. Oh. oh. Wow. This is a party. Zombie kiss this oh is. Oh my gosh. This is definitely a Halloween one, right? Yeah. Well, you should start wearing purple lipstick because, my god. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Your eyes look like ten times greener. Do you think? Purple makes green oh, pop out. Yeah. I totally see that. Yeah. Wow! I take back everything I said. They're on the opposite, right? On the spec color spectrum or something? I take back everything I said. <laughs> I was like, I'm not going to wear this purple. I will use it as a eye product. I think I'm going to wear this. Yeah! This is a very nice color. Oh, wow! This dried down so quickly. This is going to be a nightmare to get off. Oh. Have to use a special makeup remover at the sink. <gasps> oh. But! Wow! Wow, it looks different. Mmm, I'm loving Oh my god, it's so mm -hmm. much lighter on you. Can you see that? Oh, Oh my god, wow. it looks so dark on me compared to you. It's cool. Oh, this is awesome. It's a cool colour. I love it. Isn't that so strange? Like, from the bottle, that is the most intimidating shade That's of... That's very intimidating. And then, yeah. It's actually very friendly. Yeah. This is a friendly <laughs> colour. It's a nice guy. I, it's agreeable. <laughs> Wait, can you try this in the centre? Let's get weird. Let's put sugar cookie in the middle. There you go. It just lightened it up ever so slightly in the center. And that's a good thing with lips. I, I think I sometimes forget that you can create nice gradients. You know, you don't have to have the intense color all over your mm. lips. You can just use it in a little spit in the center or something like that. We'll have to wash this off. Okay, so let's try yummy. Oh, wow. Huh. 
I really like all these pastel ones. They're so cute. It's very, very subtle. Wow. I like this. I would prefer to wear this over the top of something because I can see a tiny, tiny bit of purple in there when I sort of tilt my head on different angles. I think the purple will pull better on you. I feel like these are more lip glossy than the lip glosses yeah. are. Don't you oh, reckon? The purple doesn't pull on you. Yeah, on camera, it doesn't even it's look actually, like I'm wearing anything. It's actually more purple on me. I thought it would be more purple on How you. strange. I see the purple on me way more than I see it on Tiasha. It's mm. just kind of a little bit shimmery on you. It's mm. hardly there at all. Yeah. That's so strange. That's Strange. I didn't expect that. It really feels like a lip gloss. Yeah, it's very glossy. Mm. Time for some Shrek cosplay. Venus flytrap. I don't even think Jeffrey could pull this color off. No, this is this. Who is this for? Oh my god. Poison Archie. It really is the color in the tube. The, the. Oh my god. <laughs> Swamp Queen. Uh, I'm actually not mad about it on you. Get out of me, Swamp. Sorry, guys. It's gonna look terrible regardless, so at least let me try <laughs> this again. It looks good on you. I'm sorry. Do you think? How? I don't know. I wouldn't say good. Okay, it looks better. <laughs> Maybe just slightly. I think it's just very jarring on you. I don't know if I have green undertones or what. It literally looks like sun cream on me. Like if I'm like zinc. <laughs> zinc, yeah. Like zinc. Is it a Halloween color? I don't know if that came in one of those little Halloween boxes or if that was in a normal lipstick box. This one could definitely be a good eye product, I would say. Mm. I would happily use this on my eyes. Sure. So it's not going to go to waste. Mm. It's just very unusual to have a lipstick that's green. That We've got this little skin mm. frost. Caramel Kiss. Okay. I love Whoa. Oh, okay. Oh, it's su more subtle than it's it looks in the pan. It's very chunky glitter. That's quite nice. I don't know if I could pull that off on my cheeks. This could be a good eye topper, possibly, mm. for me. It's a little too glittery, huh? But then we're, we're putting it on, like, straight, like, if you blend it out. Yeah, like. maybe if we... That's very true, Tiasha. <laughs> oh, that's much nicer. Yeah, okay. So, aside from that, there was the Chimungus lip collection. It's getting very late in the day. We haven't even done our makeup yet. <laughs> Plus, all of those shades, let's be honest, they're pretty bad. Like, you guys know. Yeah, they're red and coral and nude. And yeah, yeah, they're really nice. Let's get on to doing some makeup. Okay. Okay, so we are fresh faced and ready to do a full face of makeup using the products from the mystery boxes. We're just gonna have some fun, play around. You're doing something crazy, right? I'm gonna, my thing is like, I don't know how to do makeup anyway, so I might as well just like do it. Just, you know? yeah. just go nuts. Exactly. I'm going to try a little sneaky cut crease. <gasps> the only eyeshadow palette we have to work with is the mini breaker. Mm -hmm. But then we've got all the lipsticks and the highlights and all that sort of thing. Please enjoy watching us try to do our full face. <laughs> Oh my god, it's so... You know what, looking at you front on, I can't see it, but as soon as you turn your head, you look like a, an avatar <laughs> alien. I went inner corner for the bubble gum. Yeah. Outer cor uh, middle foreplay, and then that <gasps> purple punch. I'm getting a little bit of patchiness in this darker area. I don't know if it's because the purple is just not sticking properly, but it's really vibrant just here. And no matter what I do, I can't get it to be more vibrant on the outer corner. And I'm a little bit scared to keep going over it because I might stuff it up. <laughs> I 
feel like if you used like a primer mm. that had a lighter colour, mm. it might make the colours more? pop a little bit more. Primer with colour. Oh. I use Jeffrey Magic Star Concealer mm. to do the cut crease, mm. and then you can see like the colour shows up oh. really well. But on my lids, the orange isn't very vibrant. Right, right, but right. you can get primers that have pigment to them. Oh, yeah. okay. So I'm using the Caramel Kiss Supreme Frost. I'm actually just using it like a glitter over the top of my eyeshadow because it's not very dense. I went into it with a brush and tried to use it as a concentrated inner corner highlight, but it's literally just very fine, separated particles of glitter. Mm. So I'm just tapping my finger into it and then just like tapping it over the top of the whole lid. It's just leaving little tiny, tiny bits of glitter. I've never used a Jeffree product as an eyeliner before, so I'm kind of yes. nervous to see how this works. I don't know if I'm using the right brush. This is an angled liner brush, but I don't know if it'll work very well with this sort of cream lipstick. I really like this lipstick as an eyeliner. It's not quite dark enough though, so I think I might make this one a little bit thicker, and then I might use that black one with the gold shimmer. Like, closer to the lower lash line, so it's like a two-tone eyeliner. I'm so excited. <laughs> this is the part where it gets dangerous because you, you feel happy, but then you yeah. go adding a little bit more, and then this is where it's very <laughs> risky. You might ruin yeah. it. <laughs> You're like, oh, we could do it like a little bit. A little, oh, tiny it's a little bit boring more. up there. Let me just add like a black or gold yeah. liner. <laughs> Okay, now I'm gonna try this really dark shade. This is Soul Sucker, so this is the Halloween one. So I'm gonna try and use this as eyeliner. Wasn't so happy with how it applied on my lips, but I love that it's got little gold flecks in it. Give me a thumbs up for good luck. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like my eyes are really boring right now, so I'm gonna go in with this thing. Okay, so my eyeliner situation is questionable because I can't do a wing to save my life, so I'm just gonna leave it nice and short like that. But the lipstick worked pretty well as a liner. Ooh. Gee, you did that very well. Okay, we'll just wait till the next eye. So. <laughs> Oh, I fear the second eye. I'm so scared to do, look how nice this eye is, guys. I just want you guys to see this before I do the other eye because, oh, I look so cute. And then this eye is just not it. use the liquid lipstick to try and wing it out because I just don't have enough control with the brush that I'm using. I'll just use a standard. I want more sparkles, so. Okay, so we're gonna go try this and put it on here. My inspiration today was the Sugar Plum Fairy and I think I nailed it. Wow, that looks really Pretty. good. Does, do you feel better now? Do you feel like it's Yeah, I feel like that's what I was doing, yeah. whole face is done in the amount of time it took me to do my eyes <laughs> and I like your eyes better oh please I do it looks so nice going orange and then pink and purple it's like a sunset or I could do the Venus flytrap <laughs> Ooh, which one's that oh the green, the green. <laughs> She twiggy. You look amazing. She twiggy. <laughs> I've finally reached that level where I can do it very Just easily. Do it, yeah. It's taken two years. <laughs> Okay, I think that my eyes are done. I despise the fact that I spent so long doing this and Tiasha looks better. <laughs> oh, stop it. I'm angry. It's actually not true. Definitely think I should have flipped the colors, but I like how the mini breaker palette is like just a giant sunset. My one criticism about it, I wish that there was a more pale shade, like a nude, at least for my skin tone. I think for you, you could potentially use mm. the brown to smoke out the edges to make it naturally transition. Mm. But for me, the lightest color is that orange. Mm. So normally what I would like to do, I'd like to put like a very very pale, you know, fleshy color for me to sort of soften the edges. 
but I guess if you just go very, very lightly, you can kind of buff it out. Mm. Definitely had issues with that dark purple though. The, the purple on the edges, now that the lashes are there, you can't see it so much, but I just couldn't get it to blend. But the pink to the sort of mid pink color into the purple, they all transitioned really, really easily. So I've got to do highlight and lipstick and then I'll be done. Oh, also blush. I'm actually thinking of using maybe like the orange crush shade possibly for blush. Orange blush makes me <laughs> blush. <laughs> so nice. Okay, I think it might be a little bit too orange. Okay, highlight time. I don't know if I can use this as a highlight. Uh, I'm glad that you used the blue, because <laughs> I don't think I'm going to use the blue. <laughs> Let's give it a go. Oh, okay, no, it's it's okay. She's sticking to the lighter areas as yeah, well. Yeah, so there's darker patches around the outside, but in the very center, it's the lighter pigment. So glad to see that the little black flecks mm. do not pull through. <laughs> what am I forgetting? Oh, uh, lips, okay. Pink, or I think the nude. Oh. Over the top <laughs> of the nude. Yeah. Yeah. I think that's the right choice. I still think this will pull it together. Uh, okay, I'll do it. I'll, you've convinced me. So this is Crystal Climax. Whoa. Okay, guys, that's it. Our faces are done. Tiasha looks like she's ready for a rave. That's I would say. Yeah, I agree. Uh, if you were going clubbing or something, or to a party, or to Mardi Gras or something, it looks. So <laughs> you look great. I wear this to the shops, Alex. So mm, okay. <laughs> I'm definitely happy with the products overall. I think that I ended up with a really good selection. The lipsticks, I'm very, very happy with. I didn't dive into the red collection, but I can't wait to. Yeah. I'm so happy that that's in there. Those are literally all everyday use. Yeah. So I think overall for my very first time buying a Jeffree Star mystery box, I'm really, really happy. I think value-wise, this is worth easily like a thousand dollars, I would say. It's expensive stuff, and yeah. considering that you got the tracksuit and the mirrors and all these, you mm. know, there's the palette and every single one, and there's highlights and lipsticks and the vinyl. Yeah. <laughs> I think One it's great. Uh, I would recommend it. Uh, also, if you're outside of America, just be prepared for the fact that it's going to take like an entire year to get to you. <laughs> yeah, aside from that, thank you guys so much for watching. If you like this video, give us a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already. Tiasha's channel is The Marshmallow Girls if you want to go follow her and Millie over there. <laughs> if you like these videos with the two different skin tones, then let us know and we're more than happy to keep making them for you. With that, Thank you guys so much for watching, and we'll see you next time. Mwah! You look so good. Oh, oh, yes. 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 yes.